This is Dr. Lou Sell, a sport performance psychologist here. Now, midline triple option versus 6-1 means there's going to be double run support. So what happens is the guy over the guard is number one, the guy over the tackle is number two, and then you've got the corner, the nine tech, and the safety. So you got double run support. So the A-back has to make a tackle, tackle, tackle call to tell the tackle you got to pull and block the first run support. So the tackle is going to take three flat steps, step at 45 degrees, get his left knee through the crotch of the initial run support, left knee through the crotch, left hand to the stomach, four and northbound steps from there. Receiver is going to engage with the corner and then break off and block the safety, getting his left knee through the crotch, left hand to the stomach, four and northbound steps. He needs to engage with the corner because the A back is going to take three flat steps, step at 45 degrees, kick out the corner. Left hip in the gap, left hip up the field, right forearm, drive the corner out of bounds. So there's the perimeter blocking on mid triple. The guard's going to veer inside to the mic. He's going to get his left knee through his crotch, left hand to the stomach, four inch northbound steps from there. Center of the backside guard are going to reverse ace the A gap because there's no one or two I. So they're going to reverse ace it. They're just going to wedge together and they're going to climb second to third level while the backside tackle blocks the spine of the backside guard, which cancels the backside B gap. The guard is delivering the two uh, technique to the tackle because, remember, he's canceling the B gap and his goal is to win the A gap. So that's what happens. This guy will not be blocked. This player basically gets canceled basically by leverage. The backside receiver sprints to the goalpost. The quarterback is going to take the snap. He's going to jump back, point the ball. B back's going to sprint through the ball, sprint through the play side, hit the guard, and sprint through the end zone unless number one can take the B. And if that's the case, the quarterback will reseed the ball. He'll go off tackle, turn up, and score. And if number two can tackle the quarterback, he's going to flick the ball to the A coming around. The A will leave just before the snap. He'll get no more than a step and a half on the ground before the snap. He'll hammer step, take two diagonal steps, and turn up at 60 degrees to catch the pitch, hit the seam, and score. That's how you run mid-triple versus a 6-1 defense. You got double run support here. So the tack, you have, the a back has to make a tackle, tackle, tackle call to tell the tackle that he's blocking the initial run support. Coaches, if you want to win big in 2024, pick up the phone and give me a call. My number is on the thumbnail of this video, and so is my website. The Triple Option Football Academy and Triple Option Football Academy Camps will show you how. Go to tripleoptionfootball.com slash testimonials. You can see all the su success stories that have come from the camps of the academy. Academies are nine ninety seven. You get the academy for two years. Camps start at nineteen ninety seven. The academy is included. Go to tripleoptionfootball.com to learn more and give me a call. See you in the next video. Talk soon.